In this video, I'm gonna go ahead and review this Bluetooth speaker called Life Sound. It's a 40 watt speaker, 60 watts at its peak power, 10,000 milliamp, and you can pair two of them for a whopping 80 watts of power. It is waterproof, and there's a lot more I wanna tell you about this, including some sound tests with different kinds of music so you guys can be the judge of it yourself if this speaker is any good or not. By the way, if this is the first time you're stopping by, my name is Sean. This is my tech channel where I do unboxing reviews of tech stuff like this. So if you think you like these videos, please remember not only to subscribe, but also turn the notification bell to all because that's the only way you'll be notified for all my future videos. So the music you will listen to during the sound test, these are fairly popular music. I actually have to pay for individual licenses for only one video. In case if you're interested to use these uh, kind of music in your online content, I got some links down below if you wanna check them out. With that out of the way, what we're gonna do is listen to a single uh, speaker. I got my handy DB meter, we're gonna take a look at it, and then we're gonna pair both of them up and we'll see how they sound. But first, let's do a quick tour of the speakers, take a look at the buttons, and then we're gonna jump right in and listen to the audio. So right at the top, you have the power button, uh, plus and minus, and pause and play push and hold the power button, it will turn it off. And this does not have an auto shut off button, so you need to remember to do that. Single press the play and pause button. If there's an incoming call, that's how you can answer and hang up. And long press, that's how you can ignore. You long press the play pause button when there is no call, that's how you can reset all the Bluetooth connections. And if you want to pair two of these speakers together, you push and hold the plus and minus button together. Overall design quality, so this, uh, it seems to be all made out of plastic, except the mesh up front looks like it, it's some sort of uh, maybe aluminum. This thing has a bit of a weight to it. Almost 4.2 pounds. The LED uh, colors, as you saw, it is super bright and I actually do really appreciate what they have. The handle is pretty comfortable and easy to grip, nothing extraordinary. You have all your ports down on this side, which it gets nicely sealed. So you have your USB type C as well as um, your aux button. The USB type C, it takes power in and out. So you can use this as a power bank as well. On the website, it shows this as IPX5, which means it is splash proof. But on the box, it says it's IPX7. So kind of keep that in mind. But don't submerge it, nonetheless looks like it will be safe around the pool and out in the backyard. You also have control over the lighting effects. So basically use the power button, single short press to cycle through a couple of different modes as well as if you want to turn the lights fully off, which I do appreciate. <laughs> For wireless dual pairing, first we need to turn on both speakers and we need to make sure neither of the two speakers are connected to any devices. If you want to clear any previous connection you have, you push and do a long press of the pause button and that will remove speakers from any device's uh, Bluetooth history. So let's get started. Mm -hmm. 
All right, now that both devices are turned on, you can push and hold the plus and minus button on any of the two speakers, and you hear a ding, 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 then the two speakers are paired successfully. And now if you go to your phone's uh, Bluetooth setting and list of devices, you should be able to see live sound as a device you can connect to. I gotta tell you, this is probably one of the most painful reviews I've ever done. I had to plug my ears because it was hurting my ears that bad. And I had to unplug it obviously a few times here and there to be able to listen to the quality of it. Uh, but before I give you my opinion, drop a comment down below. Let me know what did you think about this? Keep in mind, there's only so much I can relate to you as far as the audio quality. It has to do with my speaker, with the upload, the YouTube compression, and so on and so forth. But let me know what you think about the two speakers. All right, as far as my opinion, here is the full recap. Uh, overall design, I absolutely have no problem with this. I think I like the slim form factor and the built-in handle. It makes it very easy not only to carry, but if you want to uh, you know, put it in your, in your trunk somewhere in the car if you're traveling or put in a suitcase and so on and so forth. So the design, I do like. Um, uh, the buttons are very large, so you're not gonna miss them. And I do like the LED. I'm a sucker for RGB lighting, but if you don't like them, the good news is you can turn them off. As far as the audio quality, honestly, it did feel crisp, uh, even all the way at maximum power. The sound did not get distorted. The bass was very pronounced, especially when you pair both of them together. Looking at 100, anything over 105 dB is ridiculously loud. And these, even a solo one at about a foot and a half was giving me over 110 dB and both of them paired, I think over 112, 13 dB. So as far as getting loud, it gets really loud. It does sound crisp and it has a really good amount of bass, especially considering the size of this thing. Ultimately, will this get my recommendation for under a hundred bucks? And at the time I'm reviewing this for 60 bucks, it is a no brainer. Um, you can use this as a power bank. Uh, it has cool lighting on it. It gets really loud. And the fact that you have the option to pair uh, two of them for a ridic ridiculously loud sound, I'm a big fan of it. Let me know what do you guys think. Hopefully I didn't miss anything. If you haven't had a chance to like this video, please do so. It takes a long time to try to put these together. Again, thank you Live Sound for sending these speakers to me for free to review. And until next video, be safe. And I'll see you there. Call me what you wanna, I'll be what you wanna. I've been here a thousand times. Eh, hey, hey, you falling for another. I don't even bother. I could do it all my life.